To all who come to this happy place, welcome. Good morning. Happy Friday, everybody. I got up uh, a little bit later than I usually do on a Friday, but that's just because it is Friday and we're having half days. I'm going to be going off pretty soon, getting the rest of my stuff ready, brush my teeth and all this stuff. It's going to be a pretty good day. Just getting a few things done here and there. Megan is leaving to go back home just for the weekend. So I'm going to be seeing her off in a few hours. I'm hoping to get my car washed today because it's going to be sunny for like the next week. Last night we had unexpected flurries. It was kind of forecasted, but then it was like on and off. No one could really make up their minds about like is it actually going to happen but on and off yesterday we had flurries none of it stuck to the roads and stuff but this morning i looked outside and we had on the tops of all the cars it was kind of icy and a little bit of snow and so it didn't reach 32 degrees or anything but it was cold enough that it stuck to the metal i'm going to go outside soon clean off my car and everything before i head off to work it's going to be a, a fairly chill day i'm going to try and get some stuff done around the house just trying to clean up and everything especially since houseway moved in and everything i want to keep the good impression and everything that we do keep a good clean house. He's enjoyed it so far. I'm glad that Patrick's enjoyed it since he moved in a few months ago and John is probably going to be moving out within a month. So lots of fun stuff happening here. So I'm home from work. We just finished doing car washes and stuff. I went over to this thing called Express Jet Car Wash which is like the newest car wash that we had here in Lynchburg and it was good. I had a lot of fun because uh, we had Heather with us just before both of them take off on their separate ways to go home because they're just going home for the weekend. It's Megan's dad's birthday and I think her brother's, I'm not sure. I I just know that her dad's birthday is this weekend, so she was going to surprise them, but her mom couldn't keep the secret because her dad was giving her grief about it, so it was kind of funny. They are going to be going home, and I'm going to be here for the weekend. Natalie, my stepsister's birthday, and that's tonight. I'm going to be going there tonight, and also hoping to clean up around the house today so that I can just kind of relax this weekend, maybe figure things out as far as moving to Florida, because that's going to be a pretty big step. What a day. What a day. I got back a little while ago from Natalie's birthday. It was good. It was a lot of fun. Usually those things are pretty quiet because her side of the family doesn't really like, they don't party like really hard or anything like that. No one in my family parties like super hard or anything, but we like to throw parties and stuff. And so it was a little bit more fun than I expected, honestly. I just finished eating dinner. I don't look this way because I just finished eating dinner. It's because I've done a lot today and I still have things to do that I want to finish before I actually call it a night and go to sleep. Tomorrow it's going to be a more chill day. I just really got to figure out like when I'm going to be going down to Florida. It depends on a lot of things. Being able to have the finances to move down there, getting like a second job probably because the one that I kind of accepted with Disney is, is part-time with the potential to obviously move to full-time. So obviously I would need to be a full-time if I'm going to support myself, but I really want to get my way into the company. So I need to take this job because it's the one that's been presented to me. So I would take that and hopefully, I don't know, like maybe Apple would give me a job down there because I, I love Apple. I'm, I use Apple products all the time. I work with them. So that would be very beneficial, but we'll have to see. We'll see what's going on. Um, I'm looking at probably like no sooner than really like a month or two from now that I would move down there just because I would need the time obviously to save up and everything. We'll see how that goes. And also I wanted to mention a shout out to Bradley Martin, this guy that's been like my personal fitness inspiration since I really got seriously started. And I say that because his customer service team is A plus service. They did a phenomenal job of taking my order that I received. I received pants from them that had a little hole in them. And I was like, you know what, I could wear these, but I want to see if I can get a fresh pair of pants that are, you know, spot on because I, I paid a decent amount for them and he had a discount on them. And so I was like, let's get these. I'm tired of waiting. I want to get some best pair of pants like ever for working out. They're, they're fantastic. They're comfy. They fit my form really well and everything because I'm tall and he's tall, like he and I are about three fourths of an inch apart. I'm just a little bit taller, but he's a lot bigger than I am. And so I'm like, all right, so these are what the pants would look like. And they, they work really well. So I was very happy to have received word back from his customer service team saying that they would send me a fresh pair of pants ASAP. So again, shout out to these guys and to him for making a great product. So with that, I'm signing off here. Hope everyone has a great night. See ya.